FBU National Championship is brought to you by Zenith, makers of the X2 football helmet. We're on the road to San Antonio for the 2012 FBU National Championship. Hi everyone, I'm your host Neil Sika and this is the FBU National Championship Field Pass Team Preview Show. Today, Wichita, Kansas. We talk to their team director, Manny Martinez, right after these words. The FBU National Championship is brought to you by East Bay, where the athletes are. From the creators of the U.S. Army Bowl comes Football University, the most exclusive football training in the country, invites, trains, and announces the next generation of football stars. If you're a 6th to 12th grader with elite football ability, FBU is for you. FBU matches elite athletes with elite instruction. Nominate an athlete today at footballuniversity.org. FBU, by position, by professionals, by invitation only. FBU, you know. Hi everyone, this is Neil Sika, your host for the 2012 FBU National Championship. And for the very first time, exclusive coverage of every game at the 6th, 7th, and 8th grade level. In conjunction with Swink.tv, you can sign up for the FBU Field Pass on FBUYouthNationalChampionship.com. Check out our full game, highlight, and combo packages. And we'll see you on the FBU Field Pass. Back here on this FBU National Championship Field Pass Team Preview Show. Today we're looking at Team Wichita out of Kansas. Always well organized. They will host a regional this week, December 1st and 2nd. They're in the Plains region overall, but they've got a stacked field with Kansas City, Missouri, Kansas City, Kansas. There's an 8th grade team from St. Louis, a 7th grade team from Midland, Texas, a 6th grade team from Oklahoma City. But our focus right now is on Team Wichita Manny Martinez is the team director, and he joins us now. Manny, how are you? I'm doing well. How are you doing? Excited to see you guys uh, in action this weekend, that's for sure. Thanks for joining. Let's talk a little bit uh, to start with this sixth grade team that you have in Wichita. Sixth grade new across the board in the FBU National Championship. First and second rounds, but I bet you're feeling that you're putting together a pretty good foundation for your teams at the seventh and eighth grade level down the road. Most definitely, uh, the more kids we get involved, uh, the better the product down the road. Uh, right now, uh, it's in the beginning stages, but I think in a couple of years, it's going gonna, it's gonna to rival uh, the Little League World Series. Anything that's impressed you uh, with your sixth grade team, to be specific? I have a young man, young man named Eric Solis. Hmm. He's a monster. He's at a whole different level. Uh, great athlete. Uh, he's about 225, 230. A big kid, but he moves well, uh, and I'm, I'm enjoying watching him get coached up and uh, perform at a high level. Will he, pl will he play on both sides of the ball? Yes, he will. So we'll see him he offensively will. and defensively. Uh, what about your seventh graders? They've got a chance to compete for a national championship this year. Uh, people we should keep an eye out for, and your, your thoughts on the seventh grade team? Seventh grade, we got uh, Cameron, Cameron Shepard, who is a uh, Top gun uh, performer uh, who's been nominated for the national championship team. He'll go both ways, O line, D line. Then we have Darius Russell, Juan Scott. We have a very chunk team. The core of that team is uh, the Wichita Cowboys, mm. and uh, they're a traveling team. They've been all over. They just beat Deion's, uh, Deion Sanders' team in Dallas. The Truth uh, beat them in a Thanksgiving tournament. They've been all over the U.S. playing. Uh, their coach. Jerry Page, also coach Arthur and Bryce Brown, who Arthur's with uh, K-State, and then Bryce is with the uh, Philadelphia Eagles. He had an awesome team. So then we got three or four other top teams in the city uh, in as well. So we expect a, uh, a uh, highly competitive uh, unit coming out. Yeah, Bryce Brown, U.S. Army All-American, and had a couple of touchdowns on Monday Night Football just a few nights ago. So uh, 
The, yes, Wichita, yes. the Wichita bloodlines uh, run deep all over the board. We're talking with Manny Martinez, who's the team director of the 6th, 7th, and 8th grade teams of Team Wichita. And when we come back, we'll talk about those 8th graders right after this. The FBU National Championship is brought to you by Football University, elite football training for the nation's top athlete. Let's take five hits and let it go. He was bouncing right there. He ran right to you. It's only one ball, and everybody should be running to the ball. Control the rim. Watch my knees. They go out like what? I'm climbing a big tree. Power comes from what? Through your feet, through your hips, through your palms, through your hands, guys. I've been playing chess since I was nine years old. Chess helps me stay focused. It helps me stay aware. It helps me anticipate my opponent's next move. To see his strategy, find his weakness, and exploit it. Chess prepares my mind for battle. Because victory requires my strength, my speed, and my intelligence. My name is Ray Rice, and I'm an enlightened warrior. Introducing the Youth Football Coaches Association, the premier online resource dedicated to improving coaching effectiveness and promoting youth safety for all volunteers. Register free at yfbca.org and begin receiving free youth coaching information, monthly newsletters, certification, and background checks. The most up-to-date concussion information, drills for all positions and skill levels. Learn all types of offensive and defensive plays. Join us at yfbca.org where we are making good coaches great teachers. The FBU National Championship is brought to you by Jersey Mike's. There is no substitute. We're back here on this FBU National Championship Field Pass Team Preview Show. Wichita, Kansas, December 1st and 2nd. As the National Championship gets underway, Wichita will host the site. And they've got Kansas City, Missouri to start things off. Talking about the 8th graders now with Manny Martinez, their team director. So Manny, some of these kids who played on the 7th grade, now I'm sure graduating to the 8th grade level. How are you better than last year? And you've got a tough opponent in the first round, but... Probably nice to be playing in your backyard, too. You betcha. Uh, our talent level is improved from last year. We have Coach Miller, who's a returning player from the national uh, FBU team down in San Antonio. Uh, he's returned, and we picked up uh, quite a bit of skilled players. So we're feeling pretty good. You know, we've had more talent prepared this year than last year. Uh, we've had a couple of weeks at it as opposed to a couple of days. Uh, since picking up the schemes and performing well and having a good time. You know, you mentioned your schemes, and without giving too much away, I mean, this Wichita culture of football, what are you guys trying to uh, establish as, as your creed, your motto, uh, as you look to make a, a wave on the national scene? Most certainly. Uh, the Midwest is known for uh, ground and pound, our football, big old country boys. Mm -hmm. I like the, the coastal regional teams who just spread out and throw and run and their, their, their speed. And Wichita, I believe we got both. We got size, we got speed. Uh, so, we, you know, we're going to do a little bit of both, a little bit of ground and pound and a little bit of spread. Your thoughts a little bit on this uh, first game against Team Kansas City, Missouri? Kansas City, Missouri is a good squad. Uh, they should be laden with uh, the Dylan Lamb kids for, you know, the top program in the Kansas City area. Mm -hmm. uh, they're very athletic, uh, well coached. Uh, they beat Colorado last year, so... You know, they're not going to be uh, an easy opponent by all means. I don't think no teams in this, this tournament is going to be easy, but I think that uh, I think we'll hold our own. If uh, we, we play hard and execute and we play disciplined football, I think we'll give ourselves a chance. Yeah, looking forward to that. Kansas City, Missouri, of course, was in the regional final. They lost to Kentucky last season. Mm -hmm. Eighth graders of Team Wichita, and we've been talking with team director Manny Martinez. Manny, uh, home crowd atmosphere, I'm sure it's going to be great. 
wish you the best. It's not 35 degrees either, This uh, the forecast for this weekend, so they say. So it uh, should be some good weather. 65 degrees on Saturday, 70 on Sunday. Just what the, what the good doctor ordered. Fantastic. Manny, thanks so much for doing this. All the best to you. You betcha. Thank you, and you have a great day. Team Director Manny Martinez of Team Wichita. And this has been the FBU National Championship Field Pass Team Preview Show. We've got a final thought. It's right after this. The FBU National Championship is brought to you by School of the Legends, Voice of the Players. Hey everyone, this is your FBU National Championship host, Neil Sika, and I gotta tell you what, I am looking fly in my official East Bay FBU team licensed apparel, which you can get for a limited time only on FBUYouthNationalChampionship.com. Orders must be in by December 10th, and you can have that hoodie to keep you warm no matter where you are across the country or that bag to carry all your gear on the road to San Antonio. Visit the officially licensed team apparel store on FBUNationalChampionship.com. From the creators of the U.S. Army Bowl comes Football University, the most exclusive football training in the country, invites, trains, and announces the next generation of football stars. If you're a 6th to 12th grader with elite football ability, FBU is for you. FBU matches elite athletes with elite instruction. Nominate an athlete today at footballuniversity.org. FBU, by position, by professionals, by invitation only. FBU, no! The FBU National Championship is brought to you by Zenith, makers of the X2 football. The FBU National Championship is brought to you by East Bay, where the athletes are. I've been playing chess since I was nine years old. Chess helps me stay focused. It helps me stay aware. It helps me anticipate my opponent's next move. To see his strategy, find his weakness, and exploit it. Chess prepares my mind for battle. Because victory requires my strength, my speed, and my intelligence. My name is Ray Rice, and I'm an enlightened warrior. Hey everyone, it's your FBU National Championship host, Neil Sika. On the road to San Antonio this year, don't forget, you can visit our official merchandise shops at every regional site across the FBU National Championship. We've got hats, hoodies, game tickets, and backpacks. Take full advantage and gear up today for your FBU National Championship on the road to San Antonio. We'll see you there. Let's take five kids and let it go. He was bouncing right there. He ran right to you. It's only one ball, and everybody should be running to the ball. Control the rip. Watch my knees. They go out like what? I'm climbing a big tree. Power comes for one. Through your feet, through your hips, through your palms, through your hands, guys. The FBU National Championship is brought to you by Football University. Elite football training for the nation's top athlete. Thanks for watching our FBU National Championship Desk Shows. We're on the road to San Antonio. You can catch all the action by visiting FBUYouthNationalChampionship.com and take advantage of our pay-per-view model. Extended content can be found at Facebook.com slash National Championship or on Twitter at FBU underscore NC. 
I'm Neil Sika, and we'll see you on the road to the Dome. Until then, so long. The FBU National Championship is brought to you by Jersey Mike's. There is no substitute. School of the Legends, voice of the players.